loving you always with a love that's true always when the things you plan need a helping hand I will understand always always days may not be fair always that's when I'll be there always not for just an hour not for just a day Not for just a year, but always. I'll be loving you, honey, always. With the love that's true, always. When... The things you planned need a helping hand. I will understand. Always and always. Days may not be fair. Always. That's when I'll be Well, congratulations, Ron and Sheila. And for those watching the video who don't know me, my name's John. I'm the pastor here at Rainers Lane Baptist Church, which has been a constant theme through Ron and Sheila, 65 years of marriage. So congratulations. I bet lots of people are asking, uh, what's the secret to marriage? Uh, it has been suggested that the key secret to their good, long-lasting marriage was that Ron secretly went deaf in his 20s. But I want to scotch that rumour. That's not true at all. And more seriously, what I've seen and observed as I've been the pastor for the last few years is the wonderful emphasis that as a couple they place on hospitality. Uh, Ron and Sheila love one another, but they don't see marriage as something just for themselves. They see that the love that they've experienced is something to share with others. And there are wonderful examples to us all of hospitality, of caring for others. As Ron would say, he was taught always that you are saved to serve. And they personally have experienced so much for God's grace. God has been so generous to them in Christ Jesus that they then want to pass on that generosity to others. And I can see that in their marriage. Ron and Sheila, bless you. You're a great example to us all. 65 years of marriage. So as a, as a church, we want to say congratulations. Uh, there's a, a present. There's a, a blue hyacinth uh, that you're going to get and a card from us as a church. And we want to bless you and say Congratulations, 65 years. Wow. Hi, Ron and Sheila. I just wanted to add my voice to the congratulations for your uh, happy 65 years of marriage. And I'm sure that it's not debatable. Sheila, I'm sure that you would definitely say it's happy. And so would you, Ron. It's such a privilege to be uh, to have been taken into your family and to have been looked after as sort of surrogate mum and dad and I just want to say thank you. Yeah. Thank you for listening to me, thank you for drying my tears, thank you for just being there and making me feel so loved and so welcome into your home. And Sheila, I do remember that 
Um, it's up to you to continue to keep up the profits of British Telecom and I know that you're still doing a sound job. Once again, I just want to say happy 65 years of marriage. Bye. Hello, Ron and Sheila. Uh, it's so lovely to be able to talk to you like this. Um, wish we could see you. That would be even better. Um, we're just thinking of all the lovely times that we had when we were in Woodford and our children were growing up and we were all in the Baptist church together. And the thing that I thought of was uh, the fact that in the end we seemed to be in a little gang, if you remember. And um, there was people that, in fact, have now died and we think of them with fond memories. I just want to remind you of them. I remember um, Alpha and Evelyn and um Josie and jo Alan. yes Josie and Alan and uh oh when I think of Josie and Alan I think of those amazing dinner parties and none of us could compete with that but it was lovely we had lots of fun time together but lots of good serious conversations as well and we valued your friendship and we valued your love and all the good things that we did together and all the times that we had when we had uh, trips to the Barbican and the Festival Hall and um, yeah it was really great um, yeah but it, I, I never forget you came to church one day all flustered and you said I don't know whether I've put the chicken in the pram and one of the boys in the oven or the other way round <laughs> we've never forgotten that <laughs> it's really good yeah I, I, I mean I used to think I was quite a handyman until I met Ron and all the amazing things that I saw Ron was able to accomplish in and around the home, uh, it made me feel very second class. <laughs> one of the scriptures that um, I thought of when we were thinking about this was that one in Philippians that says, and Paul's saying um, uh, about remembering the Philippians and the memories they had and the memories he had and the memories and the prayer that went up from them. And that's what we think of you. And we're so glad we've got memories of you. Brenda mentioned about being a little gang sometimes. I remember we used to sometimes gather after the Sunday meeting uh, in somebody's home. Sometimes it was Carol and Barry's home. And we'd uh, sing some of the new songs that we didn't used to sing in the Baptist church in those days. They were, they were good times. Yes, they were. So we want to say... Bless you and this special celebration and God bless you and keep you both well. I just can't believe that we've got so old so quickly. <laughs> Perhaps you can explain it. Goodbye from us. Bye Lots for now. Love. God bless. Bye-bye. Hello Ron and Sheila. I'm so pleased that I was given the opportunity to send my good wishes to you both on your very special day. Um, they say the secret to a happy marriage is finding the right person. And, well, 65 years, you're certainly proof that you did just that. I send much love and congratulations, and may you have many more happy years together. Take care. Hi, Sheila and Ron. Congratulations on your 65th wedding anniversary today, the 17th of December 2020. They say we should not waste our time on this planet, and you two certainly have not done that. Let's see, five sons and blessed with grandchildren and great-grandchildren. Apart from the normal challenges of raising children, you had to cope with the odd explosion and minor fire. Another statistic that should be mentioned is the number of new kitchens Ron has constructed. Is it six or more? We also remember those fantastic family Christmas parties mm -hmm. that you held at your various homes around the country. Importantly, none of this activity has interrupted your faith and work for the local church and its members. Have a great day and we will all get together as soon as the pandemic will allow. Love to you both, Madeline and Neil. Missed meeting up with you, Sheila and Ron. Look forward to maybe doing it next year. Bye. Bye. Hello, Auntie Sheila and Uncle Ron from the Kendall branch of the family. 
We would all like to wish you a very, very happy 65th wedding anniversary. It's a huge achievement and a good example to all of us. In fact, Calvin and I are celebrating our 25th wedding anniversary next week, only 40 years to go. It will go quick, I'm sure. <laughs> 65 years, as I say, is certainly something to celebrate and we hope you have a wonderful day. We will be thinking of you and sending you all our love and hoping it's not too long before we can all get together again. So until then, it's goodbye from them. Goodbye. And it's goodbye from me. Happy anniversary. Hi Sheila, hi Ron. Just wanted to say hello from Paul, Alice, Oscar and Cleo uh, to wish you uh, congratulations and best wishes on your 65th wedding anniversary. Woo! Woo! Uh, fantastic achievement. Um, Blue Sapphire apparently is the gemstone, which sounds amazing. Um, we just wanted to uh, wish you the best, and it's been a really tricky year for everyone, but we hope that you get to celebrate with the family as soon as possible uh, to mark the occasion. And I guess we'd also like to wish you a happy Christmas and a very healthy and happy new year. Bye. Hello. I just want to say a huge congratulations. That's a wonderful achievement. And I think friendship is what has taken you this far. I always remember Uncle Ron's cheeky giggles behind your back and um, was astonished that it didn't develop into a massive row. Um, but uh, it develops into a great big huge love that's carried you this far and I'd like to say that you've been married almost as long uh, no longer in fact than me and this lady confident <laughs> this lady this lady <laughs> Who I think would also like to wish you congratulations, my darling, too. You've been great pals all through the years with me, and it's meant a great deal to me. And I wish you all the best for your coming years. Yes, this is like the Morecambe and Wise, the surviving Langleys, after, thank goodness, that Tom's not around. Anyway. Thank you for the gorgeous buffets. Thank you for the endless memories. And thank you to the sons that made that fantastic video feeding one of your hats, doing it in freeze frame <laughs> and then playing it on the cine camera as, um, as though they were feeding a tortoise. It was cracking. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. And it's good night from me. And good night from her. <laughs> Bye. Hello. Hello. Congratulations. We did enjoy meeting you in your garden this summer. And we really wish we could be with you now to celebrate. You are an amazing team. And God's love shines through all you do. We've been thinking about Jesus, Emmanuel, God with us even though we can't be with each other just at the moment. God is with us, as he has been with you for so many decades. And we look forward to a phone call over Christmas, and we look forward to seeing you in 2021. God, God bless. bless. Say hello to Great Nanny and Grandad. Oh. <laughs> Say hiya. You're right. I did it! <laughs> I did it! <laughs> I did it! <laughs> Can you do it again then? I did it! Oh, okay. <laughs> I did it! <laughs> Say hi! Say hiya! I did it! I did it! Happy, Happy anniversary. anniversary! We hope to celebrate with you in the new year and we miss I you did. loads! <laughs> Happy, Happy anniversary. anniversary! Happy anniversary! Happy anniversary! Hi Ron and Sheila, 
Nick and Jess are here to wish you a very happy 65th wedding anniversary. It's a remarkable achievement and I uh, hope you have a brilliant day. Hiya, we just want to wish you a happy anniversary and we hope you have a lovely day. And we can't wait to celebrate with you soon. Bye. Bye. Happy 65th wedding anniversary, Nanny and Papa. And a very Merry Christmas and New Year. Hopefully we can come and see you soon. Lots of love from me and Riley. Yes. What's it mean? Hi Sheila and Ron, hope you're both well and staying safe, just to wish you a happy 65th wedding anniversary, hope you have a really lovely day. Over to you Dad. Uh, hello Sheila and Ron, uh, it's, uh, it's nice to hear, uh, hear that you're having your 65th wedding anniversary, that's absolutely wonderful. So have a lovely time and a wonderful Christmas. Hope to see you later on. Bye. Bye. Hey Nanny and Pops, happy 65th wedding anniversary. You're awesome and we all love you and we all hope to see you soon. Hey Nanny and Pops, you already know who it is. It's your favourite grandchild. Just want to say a uh, big congratulations on 65 years. You guys are amazing. Thank you for all you've done for us. Lots of love, James. Hope to see you soon. Bye.